Before we get started, please take a moment to click that thumbs up. It really helps. Thank you. Okay, and here I'm going to talk about their pricing example. And this first part is cost for existing solutions for videos. And on the left here, it says video length five minute average cost $75 per month and then in the middle here it says videos uploaded 500 videos per month at a cost of five dollars per month and then over here on the right view count shows 50,000 views per month at a cost of $150 so if you divide 50,000 by 30 you come up with a daily number of views per day on average being about I'm just going to uh, guess at it being about 1800 views per day and then they're showing the cost of that and again this is existing solutions the estimated cost with existing solutions is $230 then if you scroll down here where it says if you enable the edge network and pay in T fuel your cost would be for that same set of criteria would be about ninety seven dollars and sixty five cents per month and at the current price of T fuel I think I calculated that to be about twenty six cents per T fuel that would be roughly 376 T fuel per month saving you about 57 percent over the existing solutions out there if you were to use the Theta video API and your own website for those videos now they don't say what those costs for the quote existing solution actually is based on but my guess would be your bandwidth costs for hosting the videos on your own site and having to pay for the bandwidth consumed by all those views during the month that's the only thing that makes any sense because when you pay for web hosting service you get a certain amount of disk space and you get a certain amount of allocated bandwidth each month if you exceed that bandwidth you have to pay for the additional bandwidth used now you don't have those bandwidth costs when you're posting your videos on YouTube because they're putting ads on your videos and covering their costs that way but you're also giving up the freedom of putting out any kind of video that you wish if they don't like the content they're gonna kick you off so the bottom line is, when you come to my house, you play by my rules. The only way you have the freedom to do and say what you want is if you build your own house. Every time you depend on somebody else for any part of what you're trying to do, you're giving up a little bit of freedom. Just talk to those that were using Amazon Web Services for their hosting and found themselves kicked off of that. So really, you need to have your own web server and everything if you want maximum freedom. Truth! You can't handle the truth! Well, that's a wrap for this presentation, so cue the music.
If you enjoyed the video, then hit that thumbs up for me, and I'll see you in the next video.